2023-2024 opening ceremony. At this time, I would like to invite middle school SEA president, Abby Sullivan, to deliver our invocation. among the chaos, wisdom to see all, all as whole people, and protection against anyone seeking to harm us. Bless them with joy at being friend, excitement at new experiences, and a love of learning. Amen. Now I would like to invite Lyric Hailstock to the stage. students, faculty, and staff for the 2023-2024 through 2024 school year. I'm looking forward to having a successful year where we all support every aspect of our school. Our theme is a dream, and the Chiefs will be dreaming big. I can't wait to see what an impact our presence will have in the community, the classrooms, our athletics, and wherever else we dare to dream. It is with great excitement I welcome you back to our beautiful campus after a rejuvenating and relaxing summer break. In case you have not had the opportunity to meet me, I am Neil Meyer and I am the head of school and I'm honored to serve in this position for the 22, 20, 22, 23, 24 academic school year. As I lead this team of knowledgeable educators and talented students, it is great significance to us all to embrace our new mission statement, which is Carlisle School is an independent college preparatory school empowering students to achieve their personal best by fostering a community of character, intellect, and leadership. The mission of our school is clear and powerful. It truly captures the essence of our unique institution. We must lead by always putting our school's mission first and foremost in every decision. We are gathered here with the class of 2035 and their first grade teacher, Mrs. Jones. Parents, by the end of first grade, your children will be prepared for college because Mrs. Jones teaches daily as if her students are going to college tomorrow. <laughs> The foundation has been laid for the next 11 years of their education. Seated also on the stage are the seniors, 
the class of 2024, and they are getting ready to embark on their final year of high school. This day brings both sadness and joy because parents, faculty, staff, and administration know these 12 young adults are getting ready to experience their last days at Carlisle as students. The last homecoming, the last prom, and oh yes, senior projects are right around the corner. So seniors, I invite you to enjoy the next 173 days at Carlisle to the fullest. Also, I challenge you to dream big about what awaits you because we all believe the sky is the limit. We encourage you to embrace tasks and opportunities ahead of you. Be involved in drama, sports, academic programs outside of the classroom because participation and engagement in school are vital in creating a roadmap to your future. At our school, tradition serves as a foundation that connects us all. We foster a sense of belonging and unity through these shared values and customs. We recognize the importance of embracing innovation and progress. When things start to get hard, persevere through adversity. Many people give up on following their dreams because the work becomes too difficult, too tedious, or tiresome. But often, you are closer to the finish line than you may think. And if you push just a little harder, you will succeed. Push a little harder, seniors. Push a little harder, students. Go beyond your comfort zones. I am reminded of lyrics in a song by Tim McGraw. I know you've got mountains to climb, but always stay humble and kind. When the dreams you're dreaming come to you, when the work you put in is realized, let yourself feel the pride, but always Stay humble and kind. When you get where you're going, don't forget to turn back around and help the next one in line. Always stay humble and kind. Students, the faculty stands poised. They're ready to guide and challenge you to prepare you for success professionally and personally in an ever-changing world. Be willing to take advantage of all they offer you and remember, they are here to catch you if you fail. Yes, we encourage failure because as C.S. Lewis stated, failures are finger posts on the road to achievement. And Oprah Winfrey stated, there is no such thing as failure. Failure is just trying to move us in a different direction. Carlisle School is a special place with special people committed for ideals established by our founders in 1968. I am filled with anticipation for an incredible journey that awaits us this, our 55th year. Together, let's create a positivity where we all strive to reach our full potential and serving each other through support and encouragement in the classroom, on the stage, and on the field. Seniors, you are six years old, once dreaming about recess and spending time in art class. Now I ask you to dare to dream big about what the future holds for you. Today, August 22nd, we usher in the 2023-2024 school year. Here before us sits the precious class of 20. 35 just beginning but in 12 two brief years they will be sitting where our seniors are while academics are important so too are love friendship being part of a community and feeling safe and valued it is with pride that i introduce to you the class of 2035 as they take their first steps towards high school graduation. First graders, please stand so we can recognize you.
position, I present the class of 2024. They are about to reach the end of a milestone. Carlisle seniors who dare to dream and are destined for success. As the 12 of you sit on this stage, you are probably feeling elated because this is your final year. Understand the opportunities that bound you, opportunities to honor your time, leave your mark, and make the most of your senior year. Dream big, class of 2024. We look forward to celebrating all your successes and extraordinary accomplishments. Take the time this year to make those lifelong memories, to sell academically, and to give back to the community. Seniors, as I call your names, will you please stand at your seat? Cheyenne Alderman, Marina Bennett, Joshua Carter, Jacob Coles, Nevaeh Craghead, Andrew Cruz, Saeer Fountain Depot, Ariana Osborne, Bailey Softly, Tyler Spencer, Chris Toe, and Laura Lott Sable. I wish for you a year like no other. May it be all that you envision. Please rise for the recessional of the class of 2024.